Okay, welcome back everybody. Now, you guys had just taken these guys out and Layson, I think that there was one last thing you wanted to do in order to finish them off. Morrowin, avert your eyes. I pee on him. I pull a RJ Kelly. I'm Take definitely this. turning away. <laughs> what did I miss? Try to steal from me. Uh, you you missed me shooting one in the back, and Layson stabbed this guy, and he's unconscious now. Yeah, yeah the fight's over. And I most of them the, ran off. I stripped him and around. left him laying naked in the street. And then, and then I off. then I turned to your dog, Chuck. You want some of this action? <laughs> The dog doesn't seem to understand that, you know, you know, he's not going after, he's not going to poach your territory. <laughs> Good boy, Chuck. Chat loves you for this, Lason. They love the reference, by the way. <laughs> Only they say you need a new webcam. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's a laptop. All right, well, combat's over, and you've left this guy lying naked in the street. The rest of the I see. Let's have get out of off. here. And Please. Say, yeah. All right, Layson, you are. What do you do with the stuff that you had gotten? I put it on the. I put the armor on the quarterstaff. Put the quarterstaff over my shoulder, and when we find a general goods store, I'm gonna sell it. Okay, what about the rest of the stuff, like the daggers Every, and stuff? Everything. Well, well, what did you do with it? Well, I just, I just, oh, the arm. I the, put the, it on the armor and hung they're it off. They're daggers. They're daggers. Yeah, I, I put it on the armor and. Could have slipped it through like a belt in the armor. Okay, you don't put it in your backpack. Well, so I'll, put the, I'll put the daggers in my backpack. Okay. I'm going to look at him when he's doing this. I was like, you really want to be carrying around this guy's gear? On this little pole? town where you just killed this guy and there's going to be guards. <laughs> I want to be a little guards more guards ask me what happened, I tell them I tried, this guy tried to rob me. He's lay, laying dead in the street if he, de if he doesn't live. I got no problem with that. I do that guards on Skyrim. Gonna, exactly. <laughs> this isn't Skyrim. <laughs> I know, I'm just, I'm just saying. All right. Guards kill a thief in Riften uh, and all like, this is where crap. This is where Ryul face palms a little bit and says, you really think the guards are going to believe you? <laughs> all one of his buddies has to do is say that you attacked him and took his things and evidence right in your hands. <laughs> right. Like, hey, just stuff it in your bag. Let's I've, go. I've got some bribe money. Let's go. I say, let's stuff it in your bag. Let's go. <laughs> All right. As you start stuffing stuff, stuffing it into your bag, you notice a piece of parchment in there that wasn't in there before. I look at the parchment. There you go. It should be in front of you. Is it? No. No, only in front of Lyson. Lyson, no. Do you see it? Yes. All right. Well, it's that's what it says. I show it to uh, to uh, the other two. I show it to Raul and, and Morwen. Uh, what are we looking at here? Can someone read it to me? It says, you and your party's presence is requested at the Temple of Calistria this evening. Your protection may be ensured by your attendance. The protection not guaranteed with your absence. Well... Hmm. Fellas, I don't think I can. Wow. What do you think? Well, it's the Temple of Calestria, not Abador, so we're safe from that, at least. <laughs> Suppose. And if it's if it's a Temple of Calestria, I don't think uh, I don't think Abador they can find us there. Fine. Where's let's find this temple and figure out what the heck is going on. So, right. should I roll, like, knowledge, religion, uh, geography? It would be, yeah, knowledge, geography, in order to find it. You have a map. <laughs> well, the map is but of the nation, not the city. It's... Yeah. I know, I was just teasing. <laughs> and 21, 22, 22. Okay. 
Well, you start searching around a little bit, and you do find that by asking people, you're able to pick up some information about where the Temple of Calistria is, and it's close to the it's close to the center of town. Let's Somewhat. go there. <laughs> All right, it is currently middle. It's the morning right now. Well, I'd like to so, go to a general goods store. What are you, that's for you guys to discuss. Yeah, I, I would right. like to go to a general goods store. Yeah, this is sell this on the yeah. way. Let's go quickly on the way. Quickly being key. I don't want to be in this town longer than we have to be. Let's go. All right. Okay. You get to the market area, and you find the general goods store that Morwen had gone to earlier. And Is you guys... the uh, Zerk shop nearby? <laughs> it's around this area, approximately. The, the witch shop? Which one? The wizard's one, the magical item shop. Yeah, it's in this general area. This is the general market area of town. Oh, that reminds me. I was going to give one Cure Light Wounds Chat. potion to each of you. How much do I owe you for this? It's I'll a pay gift. you for it. Oh, thank you. I'm rich. You guys are getting kind of low from all that equipment. <laughs> <laughs> Your, All right, got one. your generosity is wonderful. And chat, he took the gear off before he peed on the guy. Oh my goodness. Chat's like, <laughs> yes. he took the pee gear. He took the pee gear. They're like freaking out about it in chat. No, I stripped <laughs> him before I peed on him. Guys, he had specified that. <laughs> I know. I was just no, kidding. actually, actually, that's another story. <laughs> oh, if you yeah. if you want a story like that, that. go. Go watch uh, the YouTube videos and and one. and listen to the uh, Up in Ashes backstory. <laughs> yeah, I'm not happy with sure. that, Sheldon. I know it was my Dog fault. But come on, <laughs> you and dogs. What can I say? So, all right, you guys are in the market area. So I go yeah. into the general gear shop, general the okay. general store. While he's doing this, I'm going to head over to the magic shop. We're or when this point didn't sure. Splitting the party again. Excellent. Hey. I should start well, punching we were... that. I really should. I'm trying to save time here. Okay. I, I go up to the shop key. What can I do for you today? Hey, I just won some gear and a duel. Oh, really? Okay. And I'd like to sell it. All right. Uh, well, what do you have? I take out the studded leather armor. I've got this armor. Oh. And then he looks it over and it's just like, oh, this is Oh, this is masterwork. Very nice. Alright. This staff. Alright, uh, it's just a standard quarter staff, alright. And this these manacles. You're not with him, Raul. You split the party. Ah, I left again. Mm-hmm. And these two mana two sets of manacles. Let's see the daggers. Let's <laughs> so I can offer you a gold piece each for the daggers. The quarter staff, this uh I can't I'm, I don't have any so it's there's no value for selling it. Okay. I'll just keep it then. The leather the leather armor that I can give you one hundred and seventy-five gold pieces. That sounds great. All right. Is there anything else you needed? Yeah, I'm looking for a couple of Tanglefoot bags. Tanglefoot bags. Let's see. Uh... Doo -doo -doo. It's a little bit of a specialty item, I think. Um, out of character and everything. Ron, do you have a 
are you looking at that in the book somewhere? Yes. What's the price on that? Under the equipment. They're so. 50 gold pieces each. Okay, well, yeah, so you can get them. Well, that's what I'd like. Two Tanglefoot bags, please, sir. All right, so uh, there you go, right there. And so I'd net like 77 gold pieces out of this transaction? Something like that, I think. Okay, thank you, sir. Yep. You have yourself a good day. You too. I step out of the shop and start looking for Roll and Morrowind. All right. I'm waiting outside the magic shop. I go join her. All right, Ryle. Right. Okay, I'm going to ask Walton to do this magic shop. Say, greetings, sir. I was interested to see if you had any magical jewelry or rings. Uh, yeah, yeah, we we got stuff. What are you after? <laughs> I was browsing more to see what might be available. Anything to help with protection, perhaps, or anything along those lines? Yeah, all these people coming in and asking for stuff, and they don't know what they want. I told you he was grumpy. Oh. <laughs> You're outside, Morwen. I have message. It's a level zero bard spell. I can whisper to him all I want. But he's not, you're not <laughs> hearing the conversation. <laughs> you whisper to him, not him to you. And you may have to have a direct line of sight on that. But I can't look through windows. <laughs> I'll, I'll have to look that one up. <laughs> Layston has been given a title by chat. Really? What was my title? Yellow, yellow justice. <laughs> Chat gets a hundred XP. <laughs> up to what? Three hundred now. Uh, yeah, so yeah, you're yeah, looking. Chat's leveling up. So. Uh, so, Brayden, do you have the list of magical items in front of you? I I don't. Should I? I can pull it up real it, fast. Yeah, you can. So. You can pull that up basically like you would when you're looking for gear. And so okay, you're um, where? Let's see. Is that under under magic things? items? There's oh, a magic there items chapter. Okay. So looking at that, uh, let's it? see. For what you want a ring of regeneration? Is that what you want? They're they're ninety thousand GP. <laughs> nice to pick one way up the list. Uh, well, well, you you don't. Uh, what do you what do you people want from me? Come in here. Oh, you I don't just, even have the I gold. Uh, well, feel free to look around. <laughs> Tell me when you want something. Okay, okay. I'm don't browsing. touch anything. Sorry, I didn't know this list was here. <laughs> <laughs> I'm new to magic. I'm just watching this through the windows. I told you so. Oh, shoot, shoot. I'm trying to find you something cool to buy. Hey, wait. Never mind, that's too hard. Um, you don't have that much. He's just uh, on the side yeah, grumbling. He's, uh, the guy probably doesn't even have the gold to get anything. It's just like, why are they even come into this? Or they just, um, Crap, this stuff's expensive, shall we? Yeah. No joke. That's why you find it adventuring. Yeah, this is why Come I on. don't bother preparing this stuff. Because <laughs> I know you can't afford it. <laughs> That's why I settled for one arrow and walked out. <laughs> Okay, well, I'll be prepared next time we we're in a magic shop. I'm sorry, we were in town. I didn't realize that. I thought you would, like, roll. I, I guess I thought you would, like, roll and randomly have, like, certain items selected that would be available in the shop, not everything. So. No, mo most I, things are I generally... This so the, the way that this works, just out of character understanding the rules, I had basically a preconceived e notion. each town kind of has a limit on what they can sell for how much kind of thing. 
sure at, at kind of as a baseline of what's available at a certain price and you, you're not going to know this going in on a town into a town but sure you kind of got to have an idea ahead of time like what you might be after because it's just like a whole chapter of items and i have no idea what you might want sure okay well i so but you have that item items list in front of you and so okay um, so do you want anything or not can you even afford anything you know i was thinking about a magical buckler but i think i think i'll hold on for now sir i appreciate your time <laughs> yeah yeah whatever oh hold on there's another stuff wow that's a huge list i'm sorry Well, look at the cheaper items. <laughs> I'll, I'll try to prepare that in the future when you guys have a town no, in front of you. Try to have a list of items that might be available in a given That's okay. Time. Let's move on. I was just, I'm just like browsing lists here and wasting everyone's time. So, yeah, we're good. Go ahead and move on. So, I'll just walk out and be like, thanks for your time. Bye. And he grumbles as you walk out. I uh, yeah. All right. Move along. Or we're going to go right, find so the Temple of Calistra, aren't we? Just FYI, yeah. a ring of protection plus one AC is about 2,000 gold. And that's a good thing. Those are good things, guys. Just mentioned that to my group, and I was like, cough, cough. Let's, yeah, yeah, well, let's when we all now. have the 200 platinum. Just saying. Let's move along. Let's go to this temple before we get, get ambushed again. All right. Well, right, after, so or we leave away. after looking a little bit, you're able to find it. It looks like what has been. It used to be some sort of mansion that's been renovated and now turned into a temple. Oh, and I need to. I bought two Tanglefoot bags, but I'm giving each of them. Uh, Yes. 28 gold pieces. Okay. This, so, is, I, this is what I got for the loot after I bought two Tanglefoot bags. Uh, so I'm giving them each 28 gold pieces. 28 for you, 28 for you. Share, share alike. Oh, you gave me 28 gold? Yeah. So, so what was it you guys are doing? You know, I know you guys are trying to focus on, on adjusting your money and lists yeah. and everything, but... We're going into this temple. Uh, going in, seeing what they wanted. All right. So you walk into the temple, and a priestess is there, and, set, and says... Ah, oh, welcome to the Temple of Calistria. Are you followers of Calistria, perhaps? I tap he is. my, I pull my symbol out and say, indeed. Ah, ah yeah, uh, uh, cleric. Just I'm have guessing. To see your eye. <laughs> yep, I wink with my my gold streaked eye. <laughs> I said, indeed. Oh well, uh, feel free to come in and. Is there anything that I can help you with? And then I said, uh, yes, this. And I hand her the note. Oh. Oh, uh, I, okay. So this note, uh, I, I'm i going to have to ask about what somebody, somebody's meeting here. Uh, I assume they've reser reserved private rooms for you then? We don't Perhaps. know. That's all the information I have. Perhaps. Well, let, let me ask, and I can find out what this is all about. She steps away for a few moments. Yes, Raul? That's all. <laughs> you, you just <laughs> watch her as she, as she walks away. Nobody's anything to discuss. As, uh, I'm worshipping. Okay. <laughs> No comment. <laughs> I'm role playing. Come on. 
is she comes back and she says there was a room reserved at one of our uh private meeting rooms and we but it's not until tonight this evening around sunset okay that sounds good that's me Thank on you. the inside uh, we can't see you more when we've just got a what? spinning yeah, your, circle your, your camera is that's so, so sad yeah we can't see your, your reactions we, we can't see your, all night. your excellent acting sad day you didn't even see me fix my ears either. Nope. We haven't seen any of it. So what are you guys doing in the meantime? Well, do we wait or do we blow town? I think we should wait and see what's going on with this. I prefer to wait, but... Yeah. We can hardly hear you. I said I would prefer to wait, but I'm not happy about it. Mm-hmm. What do you think, Lisa? Well, I think we should wait. We don't need somebody else pursuing us when we don't need when we don't have to. Good point. We got enough trouble as it is. Let's hang out at the temple for a while unless you guys have other garbage you need to take care of then. <laughs> nope. I'm good. All, All right. right. Over the course of it's probably the time. safe as it's gonna safest place in the town as it's gonna be for the likes of us. <laughs> if we're being honest. Sorry, go ahead. So after sitting around for a few hours, you get another message that comes to you from the same voice. And it says, Raul, the high priest is concerned about your current illness and would like to send a cleric to administer healing. Please give us your current location. Um, all right, I'm going to say terribly sorry. There's been a, a family emergency in Skywatch. I'm already on the road. I'm going to tell, I'm going to signal to my, to Morwen and, and the place and like this to not say anything. I all of a sudden I just like stop and say this and you guys are going, what the heck? I'm gonna be like. Alright, uh roll your bluff. Uh sixteen plus four, twenty. Alright. And then the communication closes. And I will say I am feeling most of the <laughs> I guess I didn't get that in. Well, no, no. The like I said, it closed before you yeah, finish that off. You got it. <laughs> Are you going to tell us exactly what happened? Uh, I just talking? got another message. So, yeah, I all right. I was like, okay, it's okay to talk now. Sorry, I was distracted by chat again. I was like, oh, I just got another message from the temple with their annoying scrying spell, and then. They wanted to send a send a high priest Zenith to come heal me. Uh, uh, uh. I told them I was on my way to uh, Skywatch <laughs> to on a family emergency. Yay. <laughs> Either way, I, I don't. I, I don't still think, think that's that not far enough to send them. Can can they find us well, in this temple? It was the only thing that I could think of to send them the exact opposite way of where we're going. Yeah. <laughs> Nope, I, uh, so, I, uh, Ryo, can they find us in this temple? I sure hope not. I don't know. <laughs> someone ask someone about scrying spells if they can locate me because they know who I am. If they can locate my location, see that I've been lying to them this whole time, it could be uh, interesting. They're going to want to at least talk to me, I'm sure. They're going to wonder why I've been dodging them this whole time. But at this point, I don't think I've got a choice. you gonna do i don't know how to, i gotta figure out some way to block this scrying and block them being able to locate well, me so. i start looking around for the priestess 
or who the little al- acolyte that that was waiting on us or talked to us. Do I see her? Yeah, she's not far away. She's just on the other side of the room. I, I, I go over to her and say, hey, I don't know a lot about clerical things. When you're in a god's temple, do other gods, are they able to look into this temple? Are you referring to a specific spell, or... I don't know a lot about spells. Like, what if somebody was... I don't know. Just, uh... What if somebody was just trying to find you? Could they find you in another Uh, god's uh, temple? I I think I understand what you're talking about. And, uh... Scrying, perhaps? Yeah, maybe something like that. What is what is it? Tell me what scrying is. Scrying is a spell that can be used to to essentially send a sensor to a person's location if you are familiar with that person. And then they can view and see what you are currently doing. However, okay. <laughs> however, and she, the room that you reserved, they was whoever reserved it may have known whatever it is that you might be talking about may happen or something like that because this is a lead lined room that they reserved. The temple is not lead lined, but that room is, and that's one of the reasons it's expensive to reserve. But if you're inside that room, you cannot be scried on. Would it be? Let's get inside that can, room. Can, can we go look at the? Can we go look at the room? You think it would be okay for us to wait there for our party? Well, the room is currently available, but is only used with with reservations, which are somewhat costly. What would it cost for us to rent the room for this afternoon? For this afternoon, that up until be... the t- up from now up until the time that we have to see our party. That would be 100 gold pieces. Well, I think I'd like to rent that room. You could split it. It is available at at this, this moment. So, And if you are concerned about scrying, I would recommend that you keep an eye out because when scrying happens, if you, do, if you search well enough, you can actually detect and just see the sensor just from regular sight. Okay, thank you. So but I... Would you like to reserve the room now? And I, I give her 10 platinum. All right. Uh, you you may go... It's right this way. And go to the room. Sheldon is soaking us for all the money he gave us. <laughs> <laughs> the, the, advent, the adventure sign is out. So did we... Were we there? Did we hear all this? Then? Well, Lyson walked all over to where she was at, so unless you were... All right, let's assume we followed then, for the sake of ease. No, I'll just come back and tell you. I've rented this room. It's oh. lead line. They can't scry in it. Well, that's good news. Great, let's get in there. <laughs> it cost me 10 platinum. We'll split the cost when we're in the uh, room. Okay. <laughs> all right, so you guys go into the room. I go in muttering to myself. <laughs> and well, I hand Lason back the gold he just gave me. <laughs> <laughs> Plus change, so... Yeah, I'll give you, what, 35 gold? 35. Right. Do you guys do anything uh, other than just uh, share the expenses uh, while you're share in Share the expenses, that's it. We wait. Um, I'm going to... Shoot. I'll give you 30 gold. Oh, thank you. I got some research. I need to find like some spells or magic items to keep me from getting located. <laughs> I was like, guys, we need to find a magic item that keeps me from getting scried. Because they, no matter how far away we go, they're going to be able to spot me if they do this. If they have scrying. Because they know you. Yeah, they know me well. I was there for a good year. Oh, wow. Yeah. Actually, I think it was two years. I don't remember my backstory right now. It's definitely a year. <laughs> <laughs> I think it was two. I think it was two years, too. No. Uh, so, yeah. So, 
I think we need to look into that. What do you guys think? We're running low on, or if we don't have it, though, I think we need to either steal one or well, get some more money together because this is going to haunt us until we can stay. You said that this last time they said they were going to send a cleric to you. They wanted to last time. The first time I lied naturally and told them that I was with family and sick outside of town. And that was all I told them. And that that was my, I didn't tell them my location. I just said outside of town. It's kind of vague. They messaged me again saying they wanted to send a priest to heal me and ask for my location. I told them that I was, I had left town and was headed on my way towards uh, Skywatch on the family emergency. So, so, but, I was but, told them. but what did they say to you exactly? That's exactly what they said. It, the first time was that there was a roll call for all the acolytes at the at the uh, temple at Avadar, and they were requesting locations and status, a status update on all acolytes. So that was when I told them I was sick. The next that update was them asking to send someone to me to heal. So. So they're saying they could send a cleric to you? Well, yeah, that's what it sounded like. So they can not only find you, they can send somebody to us. Potentially. I think they meant travel. Well, I know enough about magic to know there are gate spells. If someone's powerful enough to a dimensional gate, that would yeah. be disastrous. <laughs> We don't want that happening. Otherwise, our friend Zenith is going to walk up to us and freeze us all again. <laughs> Unless I cause another distraction. Yeah, that was pretty good, by the way. Good job. I'll just throw that out. Yeah, because I'm thinking after he's lied to him and after uh, we've told him we're going one place and we're obviously not there, that yeah. when they show up, they're not going to be there to talk to us. Yeah, pretty much. Hey, um, what's this? No, go ahead. I'm looking at, I'm like trying to, I'm, I'm going to grab, look around and see if there's any books on spells in this temple, Sheldon. <laughs> Clerical well, spells. We're in the room. Why don't, since they're looking for you, someone go grab me a book on spells or something. I'm going to stay in here and sulk because I can't go anywhere. I need anything on blocking, scrying, or counter spells or anything like that that we can find, or perhaps try to find a magical item with those spells in it. Well, I'm going to go we talk to the priestess this. again. Yeah, go ask her if there's anything like that way to counter scry. 